southeastern part of Washington in the fertile farming lands were in Pullman. Cold and rainy conditions, the forecast for today's game between the Washington Huskies and the Cougars of Washington State. And here come the Cougars. Yes, it's the Apple Cup. Hi and welcome everybody. I'm Brad Nessler along with coach Lee Corso and the quarterback Kirk Herbstreet. And this is the annual battle of college football supremacy for the Evergreen State. The Huskies are going to have to play a great football game if they expect to win this one, Kirk. Oh yeah, absolutely. I think you're exactly right about this. Washington State has a big advantage on the offensive side of the football and that's their quarterback. And the thing that I've noticed about him that makes him so special is his composure on the field. He's the reason they win this game big. I agree with you, and I'm going to tell you why. Washington is going to have to play a flawless game on offense if they expect to win this ball game. I don't think they got a chance. Kirk, I don't see them moving the ball much against this superior defense. Thanks, Kirk and Lee. Well, the team captains look like they're ready for the coin toss, so we'll send it down to the field. Washington is ready to open this one up as they line up for the opening kick. Kicks it off. Number 18 fields it in the end zone. They'll take over at the 20-yard line. Number 17 with four wide receivers. He drops back. Throws it out there. Number five makes a catch. And a nice catch by the wideout that time. First and ten. Ball on their own 42. Number 30 alone in the backfield. Here's the draw. He's hit and got away. And he's tackled at the 44. That was a great call. Yeah, here you see the draw play at its best. The tailback got good blocking up front and was able to pick up a bunch of yards. It's first and 10, ball on the 44-yard line. Washington brings in their nickel package. Number 17 makes a handoff. Number 18 has it. Spin move. Inside the 20. And they finally make the stop at the 12. What do you think of that one, Mr. Corso? Well, I'm going to say that was a nice catch. He got a bunch of yards there. And that's going to spread this defense out a little. First and 10. Ball on the 12. The defense will stack the line of scrimmage. Back to pass. He unloads it. He's to the 20, to the 30, the 40. Tackle at the 44. He stepped up, made a huge play. Boy, this is a nice interception. He showed great awareness in order to get in position for that pass. Let's check out the replay. It's first and 10, ball on the 44. Washington State brings in the nickel here. They throw a flag. Deep pass down the left side to the 20, to the 10. And he's in the end zone. Touchdown. Holding, Holding. on the offense. On the offense. 10 yard penalty. penalty, still first down.
First and long. Ball on their own 34. Number three comes to the line with three wide. Drops back to pass. Let's it fly. It falls incomplete. And he misses his wide receiver there. Yeah, you're right. This is an area that he's worked so hard to improve since day one. The accuracy of his throws. He's improved, but as you can see, he's upset here with himself. Second and long coming up here. Ball on the 34. Washington State going with a three-man front. He drops back. He lets it go. He drives a stiff arm, and down he goes at the 42. They threw to the tailback that time for a nice little pickup. Third down and 12 to go. Ball on their own 42. The Cougars line up in a nickel back. Back to pass. Here comes the pressure. He rolls out to the right. He passes it. Number 45 brings him down at the 43. They convert on third and long, guys. With the offense coming through in a big way that time, how about the timing on that route, coach? Yeah, Kurt, the quarterback was able to throw to a spot, and the receiver was there to catch it for a first and 10. Nice play. It's first and 10. This is the fifth play of this drive. Washington State lines up defensively in a 4-3. They'll run the option, and now he pitches it. Sheds that one. They'll bring him down at the 31. A big, big game. You know I love the option play. You get the chance to keep it or pitch it. Here the quarterback pitches it to the tailback, and they get a great pickup and another first down. First and 10. Sixth play of this drive coming up. Washington State comes out in a 3-4. Flag on the play. Number 24 takes a handoff. Number 48 with a takedown at the 26-yard line. Holding. Holding. On the offense. On the offense. Ten yard Ten yard penalty. Penalty. Still first down. down. It's first and a mile. Ball on the 41-yard line. Washington State comes out of the 4-3. Hand off up the middle. Number six brings him down at the 36. The halfback gets the call and picks up five. Second and 15, seventh play of this drive coming up. High formation here. Number 24 on the handoff, and he's tackled at the 35-yard line. The halfback picks up a yard. Third and 14 coming up here. This is the eighth play of this drive. Washington State lines up in a dime defense here. All sides. Over the defense. Five yard third down. Now it's third and nine coming up, all on the 30. Drops back to pass. Looks. Number 97 comes away with a sack. They got heavy pressure on him that time. Boy, you better believe it. The penetration got there and boom, he went down. Yeah, that pocket just collapsed right on top of the quarterback. Fourth and 13 coming up, ball on the 34. 
And this will be a very long field goal attempt. It's up. First and ten, ball on the 34-yard line. The Cougars come out in the ace formation. Tries to juke. And he's taken down at the 35-yard line. And the halfback's got nowhere to go. Second and nine coming up here. Ball on the 35. Number 17 has five receivers lined up here. Number 65 with a takedown at the 35. A yard if they're lucky on that pass play. Third and nine. Ball on the 35. The Cougar set up in the gun. He's looking for his man. Tipped away. That'll bring up fourth down. Fourth down, and let me say one thing. This defense was up to the task that time in shutting down the pass play. Yeah, they shut it down, and they got the three and out they were looking for. Fourth and nine coming up here. Ball on their own 35. They come out in a punt formation. Number 20 calls for the fair catch. He hauls it in at the 28. Three. It's first and 10. Ball on their own 28. They'll use a 4-4 defense here. Pitch left. Spins upfield. Number 59 brings him down at the 33 yard line. Holding. Holding. On the offense. On the offense. 10 yard penalty. Still first down. First and long, ball on the 18-yard line. 4-3 defense. They hand it off. And down he goes at the 20-yard line. Couple of yards there. Second and long coming up here. Ball on the 20. Number three with three wide receivers. Number three drops back. He guns it to the left. Number one with a catch. There's a missed tackle. Number 24 with a takedown at the 48-yard line. A heck of a play by the receiver. We talk all the time about the emotions of college football. This play was definitely an emotionally charged play. What a way for the wideout to make a statement in this game. It's first and 10. Ball right around midfield. Washington State lines up with five defensive backs. Let's it go. And it's caught. Number 24 brings him down at the 33-yard line. And, Herbie, that was a good-looking throw. Yeah, and what impresses me is the composure of this young quarterback. He made a great read, saw the open receiver, and delivered an almost perfect strike. Good-looking play. First and 10. Ball on the 33-yard line. Washington sets up in the eye. Number three drops to throw. He throws it. Complete. Tackle at the 30-yard line. That's a three-yard pickup. Three 
A second down and seven to go. Fifth play of this drive coming up. One man backfield. Throws it out there. Number seven. Hangs on to it. They'll bring him down at the 14-yard line. They pick up a few yards there on the pass. And I'll tell you what, that fake handoff froze the secondary just enough to allow for the receiver to come up with a nice gain that time. Good call. We are ready to start quarter number two. First and ten. We'll see what they can do in the red zone. Washington comes to the line with three wide. He drops back. Walks this one out to the left. And they got him for a loss. A loss of about six. Second and long, seventh play of this drive coming up. The Cougar, line up in a 4-3. The handoff on the counter, and he's going to lose yards on this one. Holding, Holding. on the offense. On the offense. Ten yard Ten yard penalty. Penalty. still second down. Second and long coming up here. Ball on the 30. They come out in a nickel. Drop back to pass. He unloads it. And it's caught. Brought down at the 17-yard line. Not a bad play there. Not at all. And if this wideout can continue to make plays like this, allowing them to spread the ball around, this offense is going to be tough to stop. Third down, 13. Ball on the 17. Washington State brings in the nickel here. He drops back. Let's it fly. Complete. Tackle at the eight yard line. And a nice catch by the wideout that time. This should be an easy field goal. The kick is up. And he got it. Washington ready to kick this one off. Kicks it off. Number 18 fields it at the two. They'll go to work at the 24. The Cougar come out in the shotgun. Number 17 hands off on the delay. And he's taken down at the 34. He picked up big yardage on that run. Oh, this is great blocking up front. Nice job of holding on to their blocks, allowing him to break through for some big yards. First and 10, ball on the 34-yard line. The Husky. Line up in a nickel back. Number 17, back to pass. He lets it go. And down he goes at the 46 yard line. The wide receiver picks up good yardage that time. It's first and 10, ball on the 46. Number 17, lines up in the shotgun. Back to 
pass. He's looking. He passes it, and that one's fallen incomplete. He just let his wide out a little too much that time. So it's second and ten. Ball on the 46-yard line. The Huskies bring in the nickel package. Drops back to pass. He's looking for his man. Number 55 with a takedown at the 45. They pick up solid yardage there. Yeah, nice little pitch and catch there. The wideout was able to find a little open space in the defense, and the quarterback was able to get him the ball for a good pickup. It's third down and a yard for the first down. Fifth play of this drive coming up. Three-man front defensively. He drops back. Let's it go. And it's caught. And they make the stop at the 36-yard line. They threw the tailback that time for a nice little pickup. It's first and ten. This is the sixth play of this drive. Washington State in a five-wide set. Number 17 steps back to pass. He throws it. Batted away. Great defensive effort that time. Did you see how that safety played that ball? That was a beautiful play. Second and ten. Seventh play of this drive coming up. Number 17 is back in the gun. Number 17 drops back to pass. Throws it out there. Swatted away. Nearly intercepted that time. On that last play, you see the defense do a good job of playing coverage, and the quarterback telegraphed his pass the whole way. It's third down and 10. This is the eighth play of this drive. The Cougars line up with five receivers. Number 17 drops back. He unloads it. Number five makes the catch. Your reaction to that pass play, Coach? Well, anytime you get a first down, you're happy. But in this case, you get a first down and then a bunch of yards on top of that. Ha! You're ecstatic. That was a nice pass. Let's watch it again. The Cougars come out in a two tight end set. Back to pass. Let's it fly. And it pays off. Touchdown. Guys, the coaches have got to be happy with that. Yeah, you know they are. Anytime a play works to perfection like that one did, you know they're smiling. Just watching this receiver and quarterback play together is a treat. They're a great combo. And he hits the PAT. Over three minutes remain in the second quarter, and the score is Washington State 7, Washington 3. Washington State to kick this one off. Number 42 and number 20 back deep to return. We could have a return on this one. Number 42 fields it at the seven. There's a flag on the play. Sheds a tackler. Clipping, Clipping. on the receiving, on the receiving team. team. After this, this is first down.
They'll start this drive at the 12-yard line. The Huskies go with the I formation. They hand it off. Makes a move. And he's stopped behind the line. The big guy got a hold of him there. Yeah, he had no choice but to go down in that situation. So it's second and ten. Ball on the 12-yard line. Number 24 is the deep back as they line up in the eye. Drops back to pass. He lets it go, and it's incomplete. Third down and 10 coming up. Ball on the 12-yard line. The Huskies come out showing three wide. He drops back. He passes it. Complete. And he's tackled at the 30. He's got 2,500 yards passing. That's not a bad year, Coach. Not a bad year at all, my friend. This kid has been doing it all season long, making the right throws at the right time. It's first and ten. Ball on the 30. The Husky line up in an I formation. Number three gives it up the middle. Number 28 brings him down at the 33. A couple, maybe three yards on that run. Second and seven. Fifth play of this drive coming up. Two tight end set. Play action. He fires left side. And it's knocked down. And the corner got in there and broke that one up. Third and seven coming up here. This is the sixth play of this drive. Number 24 lines up in the deep back. I formation. Drops back to pass. Number 24 has it. And he's taken down at the 40. The Cougars call for a timeout. And they'll have two remaining. Fourth and inches coming up here. All on their own 40. They line up to punt this one away. Number 83 signals for a fair catch, and they make the fair catch at the 21-yard line. It's first and 10, ball on the 21-yard line. The Huskies bring in their dime package. He drops back. Number 83 with a catch. A nice pass play there. Let me tell you, the reason why this play worked was the fact that the defense didn't do a good job of knocking the wide receiver off his route. You got to jam him at the line and throw their timing off. Second and one. Ball on their own 30. Number 17 has four receivers lined up here. Tipped away. And that was a good defensive play. Yeah, guys, this is because he's in great position to make the play. Third and one, ball on the 30. Washington lines up defensively in a 4-3. Number 30 gets the carry. 
Number 23 with a takedown at the 39-yard line. And that was a nice gain, and he's going to have enough for the first down. Well, I think, Brad, the offensive line won the battle up front. You could see the defensive line getting knocked backwards, allowing the ball carrier to pick up a nice gain. First and 10, ball on the 39. Number 17 lines up in the shotgun. He's looking for his man. He's at midfield. And down he goes at the 47-yard line. Washington State calls a timeout. And now they've only got one remaining. It's first and 10. Ball on the 47-yard line. The Huskies line up with six defensive backs. Looking. Let's it go. And it's caught. And he's finally taken down at the 18. Let's have another look at that pass, guys. Well, Brad here is just a great throw by the quarterback. He does a great job of getting the ball to the receiver quickly. Therefore, the defense doesn't have enough time to break on the ball. Set. Cut hot. Cut. Cut hot. Cut. Number 17 drops to throw. Looks. He throws it. And it's knocked away. The safety comes up with a nice play. Nice job of the safety here, sitting back and playing center field, and then seeing the ball and coming up and simply batting the ball away. So it's second and ten. Seventh play of this drive coming up. The Cougars line up with two tight ends. Back to pass. Throws it out there. Complete. Number 41. Brings him down at the 15. They get three yards on the play. Drops back to pass. Gives a little pump fake. And it pays off. Touchdown. And he makes his second visit to the end zone with that catch. Well, that was a great catch by the receiver. He ran a perfect route to get open for his second score of the game. And he tacks on the extra point. Down to just a few seconds left here before the half. And our score, Washington State 14, Washington 3. Washington State ready to kick this one off. Number 42 and number 20 deep to return. Kicks it off. Number 20 takes from the 10. First and 10, ball on the 23-yard line. The Cougars line up in a 4-3. Throws a stiff arm. He pins. Tackle at the 34. The offense calls a timeout, and that was their first timeout. It's first and 10. Ball on the 34-yard line. Washington comes to the line with three wide. He drops back. He unloads it. Bat it away. And that'll do it for the first half of play. Our halftime score, Washington State 14, Washington 3. Washington State got the ball to start the game, so they'll be kicking off to start the second half. He boots it deep downfield. Number 42 fields it in the end zone.
They'll get the ball here at the 21. Number 24 is a deep back as they line up in the eye. Number 24 takes a handoff. Missed tackle. He tries to spin. Number 48 with a takedown at the 26. Four, maybe five yards on the run. Second down and five. Ball on the 26-yard line. Washington State brings in their nickel package. Back to pass. Let's it fly. Nice spin move. Brought down at the 33. That'll be a seven-yard pickup. It's first and ten. Ball on the 33-yard line. Number three with four wide receivers. Number three, back to throw. He wants it all going long. And it's caught. And he's tackled at the 31. And that's the way you're supposed to play pitch and catch. Absolutely. You know, this wide receiver is a difference maker. He's one of those players that has a chance to go the distance every time you get him the ball. First and 10. Ball on the 31-yard line. Number 24 lines up in the deep back. Eye formation. Number three. Options out. He lateral. Number 29 brings him down at the 22. Nine-yard pickup. It's second down and one to go. Ball on the 22. Washington State comes out in a 4-3. Number 24 on the give, and down he goes at the 18. He picks up four yards on the carry. It's first and 10, they're inside the 20. The Cougars line up with six defensive backs. Back to pass. He lets it go. And it's caught for the touchdown. How about the tight end? This guy can play some football. You bet he can. He's such an all-around player. He's just as good at blocking as he is at catching the football. And he hits the PAT. Washington to kick. Number 45 and number 18 back to return. Kicks it deep. Number 18 fields it in the end zone. They'll take over at the 20 yard line. Washington brings in the nickel here. He steps up. He's in trouble. He gives a pump fake. He passes it. Swat it away. And they do a good job at swatting that one away. You're right, Brad. Excellent awareness by the defender to know where the football is and is get his hand on it. It's second down and 10 to go. Ball on their own 20. The Huskies come out in a 4-3. 
He drops back. He's under pressure. He's looking for his man. And this one's going to get intercepted. He jukes him. And the defense comes up with another one. Hey, good job by that defense to get the ball back. First and ten. Ball on the 24-yard line. Washington State comes out in a 4-3. Number 97 with a takedown at the 23. He picks up a yard on the play. Second and nine coming up here. Ball on the 23-yard line. They come out in a five-wide set. Number three, back to pass. He's looking under pressure. Incomplete. It's third down and nine to go. Ball on the 23. Number 24 lines up as a single back. Number three drops back to pass. Let's it go. Number 24 drops it. It's fourth down, nine yards to go. Ball on the 23. They'll line it up for the field goal. It's up. And it's wide right. No good. They'll go to work at the 23. Number 17 comes to the line with three wide. Number 17 steps back to pass. He's going to try and scramble. He fires right. Number 83 hangs on to it. It's first and 10. Ball on their own 47. Number 17 is back in the gun. Number 17 drops the throw. He throws it. Number 18 makes a catch. And a nice catch by the wideout that time. First and 10. Ball on the 36. Number 30, alone in the backfield. Number 30, the ball carrier. Little shake and bake move. Brought down at the 28. An eight-yard gain. Second and two. Ball on the 28-yard line. Number 17 has five receivers lined up here. Back to pass. Looking. He's going long. Complete. Tackle at the two. Can this guy throw the ball or what? No question. You can see why this guy is considered one of the premier passers in the game. Not only does he have the tremendous arm strength that we've talked about, but he's got all the intangibles as well. We're talking about poise, confidence, and the uncanny ability to find the open man. Just a phenomenal quarterback. The Cougars come to the line with their jumbo package. Number 17, back to throw. Throws it out there, and it's knocked away. The linebacker got a hand on it that time. Yeah, they were looking at six points if he hadn't got a hand in there to break that one up. Let's see if they can punch this one in. the one. 
They gain about a yard on that quarterback sneak. Looks like they're going to try to power this one in. On the ground, up the middle. Touchdown. What do you think of this guy? This guy's a giant tailback playing fullback. He's got all the moves a halfback has. He's got the power of a fullback. What a great combo. the PAT. So under three minutes to go in the third quarter and the score Washington State 21 Washington 10. Washington State lines up for the kickoff. Number 20 and number 42 set to return. Here's the kick. Number 42 fields it in the end zone. To the 30. Breaks one. That return should help the offense out a little. Yo, this kid is a sensational kick returner. He did a perfect job of reading his blocks on that kick return. Almost perfect. Eh, that's what I said. Almost perfect. And they'll look to capitalize on the good field position here. The Husky come out in a two tight end set. Number three, back to pass. Throws a lob pass out to the left. And down he goes at the 39. That was a good completion there. Yeah, I really liked the good, clean routes they ran on that play. Second down and six to go. Ball on the 39. Defense lines up in a 3-4. Drops back to pass. He lobs it left. And it's caught. Number 59 brings him down at the 39-yard line. Couldn't get anything out of that. It's third down and six to go. Ball on the 39. Number three comes to the line with three wide. Number three drops back to pass. Complete. Knocked out of bounds at the 35. So close, but they fall short of the first down. You've got to throw the ball a little deeper next time. Don't take any chances of coming up short. Fourth and two. Ball on the 35. They'll line up for the kick, and this is going to be extremely long. The kick is up. And he missed it to the right. They'll start this drive at the 35-yard line. The Huskies use a four-man front here. Number 17 gives it up the middle. He spins around. Number 34 with a takedown at the 46. Nice game for the halfback. That time they kept it on the ground with the counterplay. The blocking was great up front. The tailback was able to get into the open field and do some special things. Here's another look. Ball on the 46-yard line. The Huskies bring in their dime package. Number 17 running the option, and they got him for a loss. 
They'll lose yardage on that quarterback keeper. Good penetration by this defensive unit. Getting into the backfield and breaking up that play. Second and 11. Ball on their own 45. The Cougars with four receivers. He drops back. Looks. He unloads it. And it's incomplete. And he misses his wide receiver there. Yeah, you're right. This is an area that he's worked so hard to improve since day one. The accuracy of his throws. He's improved, but as you can see, he's upset here with himself. It's third down and 11 to go. Ball on the 45-yard line. Washington State lines up in a shotgun set. Back to pass. He's looking. He pumps one. Rifles it right side to the 40. Inside the 30. To the 20. Number 34 brings him down at the 13-yard line. Oh, my. What do you think of that one, sir? Boy, I'll tell you what. The quarterback delivered a perfect pass on that play and gave them more than enough for the first down. And 10. Ball on the 13. Number 30 lines up as a single back. Number 17 steps back to pass. Let's it fly. And they're in. Touchdown. What do you think about that touchdown pass, Kirk? That was number three, Herbie. Well, patience is the key here, guys. What I'm noticing more and more about this guy is he's very patient with the ball, and it's resulting in some nice scores, just like we've seen today. And he hits the PAT. Just a few seconds remaining now in the third quarter. And our score, Washington State 28, Washington 10. Washington State to kick this one off. He kicks it. Number 42 fields it in the end zone. get the ball here at the 19-yard line. The Huskies line up in an eye formation. Number three gives it up the middle. And he's tackled at the 20-yard line. He's going to come out. It looks like he was hurt on that last play. Second and nine coming up here. Ball on their own 20. Looks to have been shaken up a bit on that play. Well, it doesn't look like it's too serious, guys, but you never know. Sometimes those small injuries turn into seizing ending ones. They've switched sides, and these teams are all set to start the fourth and final quarter. Second and nine, ball on the 20. Washington State brings in the nickel here. Number three drops back under heavy pressure. He lets it go, and it's caught. Number 15 with a takedown at the 30-yard line. First and 10, ball on the 30. The Cougars come out in a 4-3. Here's an option, right side. He laterals the ball. Takes off a tackle. 
And he's shoved out of bounds at the 38-yard line. About eight yards there. A second down and two to go. Ball on the 38. Washington State comes out in a 3-4. Number 24 brings him down for a loss. Nowhere to go on that play, Coach. Boy, you're absolutely right, Brad. This is a great job by the defense in not giving him any room to create anything. Third down and three coming up. All on their own 37. The Huskies come to the line with their jumbo package. They hand it off. Number 17 brings him down at the 39-yard line. And he's going to come up short of the first down. Fourth and one. Ball on their own 39. Washington sets up in the eye. Number three gives it up the middle. And he's taken down at the 50-yard line. And so the drive continues. It's first and ten. This is the seventh play of this drive. Washington State lines up with five defensive backs. And they make the stop at the 46-yard line. A pickup of four yards on the sneak. And second down and six to go. Eighth play of this drive coming up. They come out with a big set. Number 29 on the handoff. Gets past the tackler. Brought down at the 37-yard line. And they pick up nine there. It's first and ten. Ninth play of this drive coming up. The Husky come out showing three wide. Number three back to throw. He rifles it to the left. Complete. Nice little catch there, huh, coach? Yeah, that was a good call. I like that call. I like short passes. They're safe and can lead to some really good yardage. Second and four coming up here. Ball on the 31. The Husky line up with three wide. Number 88 with a takedown at the 28. A gain of three yards by the fullback. It's third down and a yard for the first down. 11th play of this drive coming up. Defense lines up in a 4-3. Number 29 hits the carry. And he's tackled at the 25-yard line. And that'll be good enough to move the sticks. Yep, Brad. First and 10. Do it again. Pound the ball ahead. First and ten. This is the twelfth play of this drive. Number twenty-nine lines up in the deep back. I formation. Counter to the left. They'll bring him down at the twenty-three. The halfback gets a couple there on the counter.
Second and eight coming up here. Thirteenth play of this drive coming up. The Huskies line up with five receivers. Number three drops to throw. He scrambled. He lets it go deep down the middle. Number 24 tips it away. Well defended that time. You're right. Great job here by the defender playing the ball, keeping his balance, and getting in the way of that pass. It's third down and eight to go. Ball on the 23-yard line. The Huskies have five receivers on this play. Number three, back to pass. Rifles this one out to the left, and it's caught. Tackle at the seven. Not a bad play there. Not at all, and if this wideout can continue to make plays like this, allowing them to spread the ball around, this offense is going to be tough to stop. Washington comes to the line with three wide. He passes it, and it falls incomplete. How about that? He's got to come up with that catch here. Yeah, you're right, Coach. This is a catch that has to be made. There's really no excuse for dropping that ball. Number three has four receivers lined up here. Drops back to pass. Looking. He guns it to the left. It's intercepted. What an interception by the cornerback. This guy needs to be playing both sides of the ball. He can catch the ball better than some of these receivers. It's first and ten. Ball on the 20. Number 30. Lines up as a single back. On the ground, up the middle. Number 34 brings him down for a loss. Taken back a yard. It's second down and 11 to go. Ball on the 19. Washington lines up defensively in a 4-3. Number 34 brings him down at the 24. A pickup of five. Now it's third and six coming up. All on their own 24. They line up in the shotgun. Number 17 drops back to pass. He's looking for his man. Complete, and he's taken down at the 48. A nice pass play there. Let me tell you, the reason why this play worked was the fact that the defense didn't do a good job of knocking the wide receiver off his route. You got to jam him at the line and throw their timing off. First and 10. This is the fifth play of this drive. Three-man front defensively. Number 30 takes a handoff, and down he goes at the 48. He carries the ball for three, maybe four yards. Second and six, sixth play of this drive coming up. They line up in a double tight set. Number 17 gives it up the middle. They'll bring him down at the 45. Three-yard gain by the running back. Third down and three coming up. Seventh play of this drive coming up. The Cougars line up in a goal line formation. Number 17 gives it up the middle. A little juke. Number 21 with a takedown at the 41-yard line. 
And he gets the first down. That guy just went pow and took it in. He wasn't stopping until he got that first and ten. First and ten. This is the eighth play of this drive. The Huskies line up in a 4-3. Number 30 gets the carry. Number 23 brings him down at the 40-yard line. And not too much there on that run. Not too much, but the key here is try to milk as much time as possible. It's second down and nine to go. Ball on the 40-yard line. And that's pretty much going to do it. Any final thoughts on this one, Coach? No excuses in this one, Brad. We saw a good game where one team just outplayed the other. Washington State played a good physical game out there. And not only that, they played a smart game, too. These are smart college kids and really make some good, smart decisions out there. I like this football team. Thanks for joining us for another presentation of NCAA Football 2003. And once again, our final score in this one, Washington State 28. Washington 10. Brad Nessler for Lee Corso and Kirk Herbstreet signing off. So long, everybody.